good at crossing over. I don't use zebra crossings when I cross over. I, I, you obey the lights? I, I don't obey the zebra. lights. I mean, I'm, I'm a deep Indian right there, you know. I mean, we wait till the right light turns red, then we run. <laughs> Whether, whether you ask John McLaughlin, or mm. you ask John Coltrane, or you ask uh, uh, Chick Corea, or Herbie Hancock, for that matter, or anybody, uh, are you trying to fuse this and fuse that and bring this and bring that? They will be the first to tell you no. I mean, we weren't trying to do anything, we were just trying to play music. You know, so nobody's trying to do anything. Nobody's trying to build consciously, uh, you know, I mean, I think the only people who try to do something in the world of music are the ones who need to have a hit. When they need to sell a million records, they say, okay, I need to get into a studio and come up with a hit song. So yeah, that's when they're trying to do something. I think there was a time when People didn't know what Indian classical music is. Then Pandit Ravi Shankar happened. Mm. He was the person who not only created awareness about our music, but the whole philosophy of India, mm. the whole cultural legacy of India, the whole civilization of 5,000 years old, mm. and which is represented in our music. Miss, this is great music. <laughs> Science and technology, what they are creating, but they not compete with them. His passing is that you can rejoice that, uh, that a man left, but he hasn't actually left. Mm. And, you know, I, I said something like, you know, he just went back and took his you know, rightful place among the gods and, you know, is just watching over us from there and it's, and it's like waiting to see what we do with what he's left behind, right. you know, and that's, and I feel that his passing, although um, uh, a, a culmination of our personal contact with him uh, on, on a touch basis is uh, definitely a much more deeper contact with him now and on a spiritual basis and, 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 and maybe you know when somebody is in front of you you tend to not take him as deeply seriously as you would when he's not in front of you and so maybe the work will be analyzed more maybe there will be uh, an understanding that would come to all of us the musicians of India and, uh, and the world about his work and, and maybe it will in some ways create a a layer of, uh, you know, an interesting shade uh, on on whatever creativity is in progress at the moment, and so, so that's an exciting time to look for, and I'm hoping that it happens soon. The concept of Indian music, right, right from the beginning, was not just for entertainment, mm -hmm. although it is a great entertainment, and we call it entertainment of the soul. Mm. But beyond that, there is something else. For example, when we, we will, you will never see an Indian musician uh, coming on the stage with shoes on. Yes. Why? Because when we enter an altar, a temple, yes. for worship, we take off our shoes. This is our tradition. And why we are doing it when we are performing music? Because for us, uh, this is like offering prayer. Mm -hmm. But this Ravi Shankar brought that consciousness about our culture, about our music, about our tradition and then that tradition, that culture was adapted by the whole world. What I want 
to see is what do they do with the legacy mm. of someone like Ustad Ali Akbar Khan Sahib or Ustad Vilayat Khan Sahib or Ustad uh, uh, Ravi Shankarji and so on. What they have left, uh, you know, a, a treasure trove of information and a how-to manual behind. And, and, and let's see, I know that people like Shivji, Hariji, uh, Amjad Ali Khan Sahib and guys like those have been in some ways uh, inspired by that manual. And now today, uh, wherever you go, mm. people look up to Indian classical music, Indian traditions, mm. and uh, they uh, have come to know there is much more in India uh, beyond uh, snake charmers and those uh, things which people used to associate with India. Yes. And we are also trying to do our bit. Yes getting on this tradition. Musicians are there, the listeners are there, but who is the person who brings them together mm. face mm. to face? Mm. So organizations mm. like yours play a very significant role in bringing us together and creating this awareness and please keep doing it. Thank you, Shiva. And God bless you. Thank you. All the best. Thank you, Shiva.